Got the Buick Rivera taped up and blocked it down. Trying to get it done. Trying to get some shit done. Trying to get a lot of shit done. As you can see, it's in primer all the way around. Got to hit that mirror. Mike being lazy, he don't want to take the mirror all the way out. But as you can see, we went ahead and welded a piece of metal into the tunnel we got a buick riviera in the yard that they trying to sell and we hoping it don't sell is a, a solid car i don't think nobody gonna buy it i think it's gonna go to the back of the yard but we waiting on it to go in the back so we can cut the flow pans out of that but we did well the tunnel in as you can see I went ahead and spot welded the tunnel in for Mike. Try to get some shit done. But I told Mike, look at the mirror that fell on. I told Mike, don't worry about, um, don't worry about the floors because we can put the floors in once everything done. Just go ahead and finish the body work and go ahead and paint it. That's why you see it all taped up, gang. Then got this El Camino over here. Worked out a little something with John Blaze. Went ahead and spot welded them floors in for him. As you can see, need to be grinded down, seam sealed, and then we'll go ahead and hit the whole flow. While you will the whole flow, scuff it up. Hit it with some rusty capsulated and paint, but as you can see, everything's solid now, baby. Y'all see it? They had plaster or something in that bitch. There ain't no plaster in there now. We got metal in there now. Get it. Getting some shit done. You know? Take a walk in the boot and show y'all what we got going. We got the Skeleton of redness scattered out in the boot. Just finished tack cloth on the down. Getting rid of the, you know, spray the back sides and shit. Spray the, I'm about to, I'm about to, um, what I'm about to do is I'm about to seal all these back sides with a black sealer. Cause y'all know we going with that brandy wine. So I'm about to, I'm about to seal all these back sides, me and Money Mike with the black sealer. And then we gonna come back and um, put that sucker with some base coat, but I'm gonna keep y'all dialed in and let y'all see all what's going on. But we about to hit this sucker with some um, black sealer. Cause I don't, I don't really want that wine look. Cause it's supposed to be that dark maroon burgundy look. So that's the look I'm going for. So I don't want to spray over this light gray primer with uh, we don't want to spray over this light gray primer with that maroon, cause then we gonna get that wine look. I don't want that, I want that dark look. I want that sucker looking factory. So when I slide them wheels up under there, everything looking official, gang. But what we about to do is, 
I ain't about to talk your head off because we in here late night. It's late right now, about 11 o'clock. We about to go ahead and seal this shit up. I'm going to cut y'all on we start sealing it up with the black sealer. And then we're going to let that flash off. This all backside, the backside, everything. Y'all see we got the cold naked, baby. We're going to um, let that shit flash off. Then I'm going to cut y'all back on when we spraying baits. And then I'm going to cut y'all back on when we spraying the clip code. Gang is with the rebuild. Stay tuned, locked in. Money Mike, you got something you want to tell me? Yeah, we'll be back in a minute with Black Park. <laughs> y'all heard it, gang. <laughs> We about to seal this shit in black and I'ma cut y'all back on. What a rebuild, baby. Stay the back, gang, y'all see. Money Mike to move the shit around where he can walk good. Brand it with the black seal. Cause we out there. We out for that dark maroon color. And this is the bottom side. Bottom side of the panel. So you can see, bottom side of the panel. We're gonna do the same thing once we seal all this in and lock everything in. We're gonna go ahead and um, put everything back on the coat. Seal the whole coat in black. And then come back with the uh, with the sealer again and seal everything in. So you can get that nice dark look. Dark look. Mike said you want that dark look. Rich look. Rich look. I ain't rich, Mike. I'm hard. I'm working hard than the motherfucker. I ain't rich now. But guess what? When I drop them three piece wheels under there. <laughs> I might look rich, but I ain't rich. I'm working like a dog, baby. I'm working like a dog. The dog here, that's what we're going for. We're going to we're trying to get that maroon to be dark. We want it dark. That's why we don't want to paint, uh, paint over that green primer, because that's going to lighten the color. And as you can see, listen to your painter, man. This is to the paint. I can do some shit, but at the end of the day, the man tell me what he want to do, and I'm letting him go and do what he want to do, man. Same way when I'm building a motor for somebody. Once I tell him what I want, get me what I want and let me do what I do. Don't go to trying to be combative and shit with what I'm saying and telling you I need to get the job done, baby. Give me what I want and let me do my thing. You know what I'm saying? So, fuck it. I went and got him some more primer and let him seal this shit in black. He wanted a maroon or a gray, uh, a maroon or a red, but I told him, Mike, I can't get that over there while I'm here. The man said he got black and dark gray. Which one you want? He said dark gray. I said, fuck it. He want to go rich, I'm going to get black. So that's what we got right here, man. We got black silver primer. We're sealing this shit up and we about to spray it. You mix the spot right there under the box. Well, we ain't miss it. It look light though. You might need to hit around here again. Alright. Let me get out of the way, gang, because I'm trying to recover and bumping into shit on the way out. But I'm going to cut y'all back on and just give it, let y'all see what we're doing. Huh? Spraying the shit black, and then we about to come with some bait on that. But this shit here flash off. And get the job in, gang. With the rebuild. Showing y'all, telling y'all how I do it, man. Top to bottom. Get shit out the field that's a rust bucket. On the way to the crusher. And we bring that shit back to life, man. Yeah, yeah. Alright gang, y'all see it, got this shit sealed in in black, as you can see, all the parts 
concealed in in black. Hood. Trunk. Spoiler. The piece go behind the trunk. Fenders. Blue fenders. The doors. That's prime and sealer game. Reduced down to sealer. And the reason we went ahead and did that is because we don't want the couple of the small pieces right there. All this stuff gonna go back on the car. Outside gonna get sealed. As you can see, that's looking factory, Jack. Looking like factory, baby. But the reason we did this is because when we spray that burgundy, that brandy wine, which y'all picked out, we don't want the color to come back looking light. We want it to look dark and rich like it's supposed to. So that's why we sprayed that black seal on there, as you can see. And then we gonna come back over that with the base coat, the outsides of all this, we gonna water sand it down and make it look like it's supposed to look, gang. Project Redness, baby. Project Redness. We about to go ahead and wrap up, gang. I know y'all been seeing their pieces, but with a rebuild and Money Mike, the 30 year body, man, we about to wrap this bitch up because I got some more projects about to come in. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. You seen this shit? From the driveway to area 51, and now you're seeing the pieces in the paint booth. But you can do all this shit at home. Basically, that's what we're doing. We're doing it at home, baby. So if I can do it, you can do it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. It's Willie Rebuild, over and out. Coming with base coat, clear coat. On the back pieces, on the back sides, tomorrow. Base coat, clear coat. Let me go walk out here so y'all can see Money Mike, the 30 year body man. He's sweeping some shit up. I like to sweep up the dust. He getting the dust up. Trying to keep this shit clean, gang. But as you can see, we coming back tomorrow. We got. Base coat, as you can see, on the stick. Yes, sir. That maroon. Base coat, shop line, base coat. And this one we gonna go ahead and clear it down with the JC6700 shop line clip, baby. 12 o'clock at night. Willie Rebuild telling you, the guy at home who gonna watch this video and sitting back contemplating about taking his fucking car across the scale. <laughs> Willie Rebuild telling you, don't do it. Don't take the bitch across the scale just yet. Because if I can do it, you can do it. And Ratness was one ride away from the scale if Willie Rebuild wouldn't have came and saved it and shake it back and bring it back to life, gang, and have it at, sitting at the red light and the motherfucker pull up on side me saying, that's a clean motherfucker. Just like the Riviera. She might have been one, one step away from going across the scale. So I'm motivation to you telling you mm -hmm. don't do it and bring it bitch across the scale because one man trash is another man's treasure, gang. It's Willie Rebuild over and out with Money Mike, the 30 year body man, coming back tomorrow with base coat, clear coat on the right. back side of all the panels. 
we one step closer to having that motherfucker in traffic and sitting at the red light and really rebuild, pat on the gas and leave sideways, gang. Moving <laughs> out.